It's tonight a rare look at a statue of the last ruler of the Aztec Empire. The sculptor's son and grandson got to see it today for the first time in more than 20 years. It remains atop a pedestal within Miraflores. It's a private sanctuary created by a San Antonio physician a century ago. The Brackenridge Park Conservancy working with the city to develop plans to make it a public park just north of Bar Broadway along Hildebrand. Jesse DeGriado has more. The son and grandson of Luis Sanchez carefully and lovingly touch the statue his hands had created. That's why I rub it and it's not only a statue, it's a symbol, it's a legacy. It means so many things. The statue is that of Mexico's last Aztec ruler, Cuauhtémoc. I noticed that there's an H missing between the U and the T. Maybe my dad didn't have enough room. <laughs> Cuauhtémoc is remembered for his futile effort to save the Aztec Empire from the Spaniards who'd won over Moctezuma in their quest for gold. Cuauhtémoc has his clenched fist thrust in the air for a reason. Protesting against the sun god for having allowing the Spaniards to conquer their land. The statue is badly in need of repair, like much of Miraflores. A private sanctuary built by Dr. Aureliano Urrutia nearly a century ago, it's now in the hands of the Brackenridge Park Conservancy. Plans are in the works to restore the glory that was Miraflores, but as a public park. This location is the confluence of cultures. People coming from Mexico as they fled during the Mexican Revolution and establishing their lives here and making themselves part of the community. Funds are being raised for its restoration, including the striking statue of Guatemoc. Jesse de Gullado, KSAT 12 News.